Turkey is a partner of key strategic importance to the European Union in terms of security, stability, prosperity and energy supply. I am aware of the impatience of Turkish business on further progress on visa issues. Let me just to mention one important issue related to the business. And this is often forgotten. I would like to remind all of us that Turkish migrant workers make a vital contribution to the European economy, even with the current visa regime. But more importantly, the Justice and Home Affairs Council, February this year, has opened a clear perspective for an intensified cooperation on visa issues. At the same time, the European Union is the key strategic ally for Turkey as well. We provide most of its technology transfer, two-third of uh, its uh, uh, foreign direct investments, and we are the biggest trading partner. Yet this massive mutual interest uh, often goes unreported and un unacknowledged as media coverage focuses on the political challenges facing the accession process. And we have to recognize that uh, there are important political issues that currently impede progress in the accession negotiations. And I would expect the Turkish government to address these political issues in a decisive manner after the elections. Looking to the future, our common challenge is to deepen European Union-Turkey integration even further. The accession negotiations are the best tool to do this, not just in the narrow economic sense, but uh, also through anchoring the rule of law. I would like to emphasize that continuation of structural reforms is of vital importance in order to ensure the sustainability of the economic gains of recent years and to better protect uh, the economy from future eventual shocks. Furthermore, a long-awaited revitalization of Turkey's political and institutional reform process to accelerate the country's democratic and economic transformation would further strengthen our business and economic ties and attract even more investment.